About seven years ago, the concept of HIV self-testing was still quite controversial. People worried that without a healthcare worker present to deliver the results of the tests, people who got positive results might consider self-harm or suicide. Research has since shown that that's probably not the case. Last year, the Pharmacy Council of South Africa approved the sale of over-the-counter do-it-yourself HIV testing kits. These are now available at major retailers like Crick's and go for about 60 Rand. South Africa is one of about 23 countries globally that supports HIV self-testing in its national guidelines, although implementation has been slow. Here's how HIV self-testing works. Clean your fingertip with the alcohol swab provided and then dry it off with a clean tissue. Take the pipette and collect a sample of blood. Try to avoid getting air bubbles in there. Place two drops of blood into the oval opening on the testing strip. Cut open the sealed pipette and add one drop of liquid. Wait two minutes. One line means the test is negative or has not detected HIV antibodies. Two lines mean that the test is positive and you should go to your nearest clinic for a confirmatory test. South Africa now offers HIV treatment as soon as you test positive. If you think you've been exposed to HIV in the three months before you've taken the test, you should take another test in three months just to make sure. Most tests won't pick up the fact that you're HIV positive within the first three months of you being infected.